Well, it's mostly used to skip, like, the nights and stuff, so... Well, that's what I'm asking, is if you can only do it once in a 24-hour period, you might try and wait until the last time you did it. The time. I mean... Yeah, no, if she was gonna do it, she'd do it. Oh, so it's all her fault. It is all her fault. I'm blaming her. Stupid old bat. Yeah, you can't blame the little old lady in a wheelchair who doesn't know any better. Hey, if the fairy can blame me for her getting stuck with me after she punched me in the face, then I can blame an old lady in a wheelchair. <laughs> I have no argument for that. Yeah, exactly. Uh, well, that's just explore. Here's the mayor's office. Well, the mayor's wife's bedroom, mayhaps. Oh, scandalous! And there's nothing of importance in here, so. Yeah, all this stuff's important a lot later. I'm not even gonna deal with them right now. I only thought that happened on the first day anyway, so this is a surprise. Whoa, lag, hey. How's it going? You wanna you wanna stop that? You don't. Alright, well we'll just run backwards then. Anyway, this is the bar that we can't get into. Because it's too early? That and we're a Deku scrub. Um so this is where you do bowling and stuff. That's gonna so be... you can go bowling! Well, yeah, but you have to do it as a human. Because, oh. again, we're a scrub. Uh, this is the shooting gallery. Yep. And a scrub can't get any love. Pretty much. Well, he was hanging off the passenger side of Epona. So, <laughs> there's that. <laughs> See, even the puppy thought it was funny. <laughs> the puppy is busy trying to chew off my arm. That sounds about right. She took a long nap, got restless, got tired of chasing the cricket, and decided to go after me instead. After I killed the cricket. Ah. So this is the uh, Swords Master, I think. Right, yeah, Swords Master. Uh, get a heart piece okay, okay. there. This is the mailman. You can't get a sword until you're human. Yep. Oh, this is the least visited place. Uh, NLPs. And I think just in general. It's the lottery. Now, again, since we have awesome, like, Groundhog Day power, um, we can abuse the lottery and win every time, but it's a pretty shitty way to win money. Like, there's better ways to get money in this game than doing the lottery, and that's why nobody really does it. And all those will become available once we're human. You get a lot of stuff when you become human, because being human is better than being a scrub. Because racist game is racist. <laughs> That's right, puppy, you tell him. Yeah, so I think we've been 
pretty much everywhere in town. Um, there is a another little game just for scrubs on the left side of the. Not the passenger side. No. Uh, on the left side of the ferry fountain. But you have to do it all three days, and you have to score a perfect score. And on the third day, they give you a heart piece. So I think with all the heart pieces I know about, I could probably get at least one or two before we actually, like, do a dungeon or something. But I'm not really super concerned about it. Is that a hippie? Uh, yes. Oh, it's a scarecrow. <laughs> I didn't see what it did, what it was. I just yeah. I don't know. I thought. <laughs> Yeah. The Scarecrow has one purpose in the game, and that's not till much, much later. And even then, but it's it negligible at best. What? I said, but it is not a hippie. It is not. I mean, he might be. If he only had a brain. <laughs> So, also, you might have noticed that I've been spinning just before I hit the water. And that's because in this version, spinning gives you a little more momentum when going across the water. Water. Which they took out for the 3DS remake. Why, of all things, they took that out, I have no idea. Especially since it's just more of a quality of life type of deal. But they did. It's like the backflip being changed from an awesome backflip to a slow, majestic backflip of grace that has no real combat usefulness anymore. Though, to be fair, there's only, like, a f mm, two or three enemies that you would actually use the backflip on. Alright, let's see if this thing is here yet. Let's see. Hello! Oh. Hello! Nope. Okay, I guess not. Nothing? Nothing. Alright. I don't remember a whole lot about this game. But it's about to be midnight. <clears throat> Which is why we need to... Get into position. I don't think I'm gonna get into position before, because it's about to go off right now. So every three days there's a big fireworks show? Yeah, because it's a festival. And then that opens, and that's where we want to be. Because that's where the school kid's at. And he stole our stuff, and we need our stuff. And we have five minutes. Well, six minutes, really. Or six units of measure, because those aren't actual minutes. Um, we have six units of measure to beat the game and win. And if we don't, it's game over. 
The crappy thing about this is we've been playing for roughly about an hour now. And this whole first cycle, you can't save at all. You have to play this all the way through before you can save. Are you serious? Yep. That is terrible. Yep. Skull Kid, you're evil, you're a big ol' jerk. And then he's like, Swamp, Mountain, Ocean, Canyon, blah blah blah, gets bitch slapped. Ah, you're out of line. Oh no, what are you doing? You're a big ol' jerk. I don't need friends, I've got mask power. <laughs> power up! Why does the light or whatever that he emits go toward the big nose on that statue? That's the moon. No. What, the light is the moon? No, that is the moon. Oh. That's the moon. The moon has a nose. And he's oh. trying to pull the moon down into the earth so he can kill everybody. Oh. I guess I missed that. Yeah. Anyway, Princess Zelda... It's the only time in the game you hear mention or see her. She said we're leaving because she wants the D. She wants to live with us and all that stuff. But we took the acid, so we have to go down the rabbit hole. And she gives us this. And I guess they decided that the Song of Time didn't have enough use in the Ocarina of Time that we now have to use it now. If I was smart... Oh yeah. That's not using C sticks at all. So that's why it's awesome because I was hitting buttons. Buttons, buttons. Because the GameCube has Y, X, and um, Z. Well, the N64 controller had Z. But Y, X, and Z. I think it was Z. The purple button. Right. Anyway, so that button in this game corresponds to a spot on the C stick. So you didn't have to use the C stick if you didn't want to. Which I did map the C stick, but I just don't care to use it. Yeah, we need more time. Oops. Yeah, I really need to... So, on the Xbox controller, I mapped Y to C left and B to... Or, Y to C right, B to C left. Which, on the controller, Y is, more, is left of B. So, that's why it's kind of messing with me. Anyway... We have pipes. Oh, okay. We're saving, apparently. Yay! That was awkward. That's what time travel really looks like. Now this looks like something from Alice in Wonderland. <laughs> However, we can only go back 
so far. See that little intro in the beginning? That all still happened. We go back to where we first meet the Happy Mask Salesman. Or just after meeting the Happy Mask Salesman, rather. Why we time travel back to this specific point in time, I have no idea. What just happened? Everything has... Start it over! And you only get this cutscene the first time, obviously. The moon is creepy! The moon's supposed to be creepy. Now, for whatever reason, in Acid Land, when you play the Song of Time, you time travel. Whereas in Hyrule, when you play the Song of Time, giant blocks move. I think that's a pretty fair assessment of what it did in the Ocarina of Time. Anyway! Yo, dude, we got the thing. Yep, we got it. And he's being all creepy. And magically pulls an uh, organ out of his pants, I guess. I don't know. My turn. That one. I made C down uh, right trigger, so it's kind of weird. Because I'm used to it being, like, where RB is. Because that's where it's at on the GameCube controller. And then we're like, bye! We don't like you! Oh, and our first mask. And Link's like, huh? Thank God. He's got a penis again. He's happy. <laughs> well, we can put on that mask anytime and turn into a scrub. I do like how they uh, made it so you can see through the little mouth hole, though. <laughs> that is cool. It's a nice little touch, I think. Anyway, so at the beginning I skipped over everything that he said. But pretty much we told him that if he helped us change back, we'd get him his mask that the kid stole. But obviously we didn't do that because that's the end of the game. So he's going to be super angry with us. Yep, see, that's horrifying right there. Look at that. We're going to we're going to get shaken baby syndrome here. I mean, look at his eyes. He's scary. Now he's gonna tell us the mask was called Majora's Mask, name drop, and that it's pure evil. Because it's purple. And we all know purple things in video games mean evil. So instead of destroying the mask, they seal it away. Get the mask and do it quick. I'm bugging you. Yep, okay. Yep. Yep. Cool. Okay, so there's a couple things you can do. 
with our newly acquired human body and penis. Before you get to that, I think I'm going to call it a night. Well, yeah, I was going to do, like, one more thing. Okay. Anyway, so Tattle's like, hey, that stuff my brother was saying seemed important. We should go to the swamp, because he said swamp first. Anyway, so the dog won't try and kill us. We have the, uh... Ocarina... What is it? No, wait, hold on. It's... Uh, uh, uh. Ah, well, I'll have to, like, map it out. <laughs> if you play the Song of Time backwards, it'll slow time, and then if you double note every note in the Song of Time, it'll jump time forward six hours. In this version, in the remake, you can actually pick what hour you want it to go to specifically, which is a lot more useful. But we're not doing that. So the first thing we need to do, instead of having to catch all those kids again, since we already know their secret code... We can just tell him. And he's gonna be like, yeah, that's the right code, you're amazing. herp de herp de derp we're gonna go, thanks, kid! Then we're gonna go back. And then Jim's gonna be like, what the hell? And then he's gonna be like, you're awesome, and you're also not a scrub, so you can totally be a bomber. And he's gonna give us this handy dandy little notebook, which lets us track all the stupid side quests in this game. Yep, 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 yep. Yep. Cool. And then he's gonna run away. Bye, Jim. Nobody loves you. You sad, <laughs> sad little kid. Alright, I don't know if I can do this quite just yet, but I'm gonna try... Ugh. Most people do it with the... Bunny hood. Oh, apparently you can do it. Cool. So, you want a quick way to make the moolah. Up over here, and again I'm rolling before I'm jumping, so it's giving me extra distance. Just like in Donkey Kong. Um, anyway, that's a hundred rubies. There's a hundred rubies back where that little kid is. As well, you need bombs before you can do that, so we'll worry about that later. Uh, I'm actually going to deposit these before we leave. Now, I know you're like, well, why'd you get the bomber's notebook? Th why is that important? Well, it's important. Hello, guy. Alright, it's important because I never have to catch Jim again. Because that's the code, which is nice. And like you said, there's 20, like, main side quest things, but some of them are longer than others, and they twist and turn and do all this crap, and it's really stupid and annoying. Yay, we're almost there. Okay! So now we can save. Oh, hold on. So this game, the only like true way to do a hard, hard save was to play the song of time and reset everything. But you could do like interim saves. Oops. 
by hitting an owl statue, which is something they also changed in the remake. Um, so if you save at an owl statue, it'll save your game, but when you reload that save, you'll it'll no longer be a hard save. So it's kind of like a temporary save kind of thing. Um, which, again, they changed in the 3DS remake to make it so it's permanent saves as well. But that's all we wanted to... Wait. Over and... No. Damn it! There we go. Figure it out eventually. Big girl puppy. And we're saving. Which hopefully it does actually save. It's saying it's saving. But I'm not really sure if it is or not. There's like no save states. I know the problem. But, that's gonna do it for this time. Like I said, I might... Uh, go ahead and do, like, the first temple deal. We'll see. Oh, and since we actually have magic now, we can do that. Or that. Which is a lot easier to do with this stick than the uh, 64 stick. Hey, your audio is cutting in and out in some parts. It's cutting out for you, woman. You tell me how to live my life. <laughs> so, anyway. Bye. Hope you had fun. Bye. Oh, real quick. One more thing we gotta do. Yeah, damn dirty mongrel. Yeah. Yeah, that's right. How you like it, jerk. Ha, 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 ha.